Welcome back on this Monday morning. Today it's going to be another hot one with some showers and some thunderstorms. We will see clouds increase throughout the day as well. So, you know, as far as heat is concerned, it might be a good beach day, but you have to keep an eye to the radar because we'll dodge some of these showers and thunderstorms. Not that it's going to be a widespread or a total washout or it'll completely ruin your day, but you know, You'll have some around there, especially in the central and east, which could delay and put off some beach time for you a little bit. Remember to stay safe. You hear thunder, you see lightning, go indoors. Don't be outside. Don't be on the water. Don't be fishing. Not good places for you to be in those events. So a hot one today, cooler for tomorrow and on Wednesday with some showers and the rest of the week looks a little bit more seasonal. Here's the hour by hour for those temperatures today into the upper 80s, especially to the south, most places easily well into the 80s. We're supposed to be in the mid 70s and then as we head into tomorrow, we'll have more of a north to south split early on. Highs will happen early on because we'll have temperatures fall throughout the day as a front moves through. So look for generally 60s across the north and then right around the 80 degree mark in our southern counties. Those temps falling as we head into the afternoon and evening. Right now at the surface, we have a stall front just to our west and that kind of moves through today, but this secondary front is is going to be moving through tomorrow and it'll bring in the opportunity for seeing those widespread showers and some cooler air. Right now at the moment though we're seeing just a small little line of thunderstorms across our western counties and right over parts of Iron County as well. So we'll zoom into just a few of these locations to the east. This one is in southern Houghton County extending to just north of Iron River. And this one over here is right along the Wisconsin state line west of Iron Mountain. Just a few strikes of lightning with these. Here's your hour by hour for today. Going to see more of those showers and thunderstorms developing in the central and eastern areas this afternoon. This is 2.30 in the afternoon and then overnight kind of a quiet one. Tomorrow morning about 10 to about 11 o'clock in the morning, we'll start to see some more showers work into the western counties, mainly showers. Could see one or two be thunderstorms, but mainly just some rain with this and then becoming more widespread as we head into the afternoon and evening. That was seven o'clock still continuing for the overnight Wednesday morning. We'll start to see some of this rain in the south continue to taper off. We'll have a drier Thursday and Friday headed your way. Rainfall amounts easily half of an inch to locally an inch, if not a little bit more to our southern counties. The least amount right over into the Keweenaw for the next day to two days. A little bit cooler behind that front. So for Wednesday, generally into the 60s and then looking for 70s for the rest of the week. We have more sports on the way. Up next, TV6's Tyler Markle introduces us to a Kingsford High School football player 